our previous video was a comforting and aromatic palm nut soup chai and today the weather is super cold the weather is calling for four legs so let's make chicken lye soup with no garden eggs to warm ourselves a very warm welcome to the channel if today is the first time here my name is Yummy Cash. So with me, I have my chicken. I'm using hard chicken for this recipe. You can use soft chicken if that is what you want. And I roast it on the fire for about five minutes to remove the excess feathers on the chicken. You know, whenever you're making your chicken, so do not skip this step because it enhances the flavor and the taste of your soup. So once you're done with the roasting step, you wash it neatly and cut them into small sizes. Put them in a pot and set it aside. Now in the pot, I add in the vegetables and add in some water. Cover it and bring it to a boil. The vegetables have been cooking for about 10 minutes now. I check it, it is soft, so I'm going to take it off from the fire and set it aside. And thus as my chicken, I washed and cut them beautifully. I'm now adding in some spice mix, then introduce in some chopped onions. I will now add some salt to taste. I now come in with one tablespoon of tomato paste. Next is to add about half cup of water, cover it and start cooking the chicken. It is now time to blend the vegetables and I'm going to use the hand blender to blend them. That is why I am transferring everything into a bowl and then adding some gingers and some garlics. I'll pour water into it and start blending them nicely. If you're using the normal blender for this step, you know what to do, right? You just put them in the blender and then blend them nicely. So I'm done with the blending step. The next thing to do is to strain the blended ingredients. Pass the blended ingredients through a colander and then ask you, are you subscribed to the channel? If not, then kindly hit the subscribe button. Do not forget to like this video and share it out. I am done with the straining step and as you can see, the chaff is too much. It couldn't blend very well, right? So I transfer the chaff back into the bowl add enough water to it and blend it for the second time once again i strain it for the second time for the list of ingredients used in this video i will list everything down in the description so you can check it out So look at how the juice is looking super beautiful. I just love it. All right, the chicken has been on fire for 15 minutes now. I give it a quick, beautiful stir. Now when it comes to the protein or when it comes to the chicken, you can customize it to your preference. So at this point, I tasted for salt to make sure that the salt was super enough left it on fire for additional 15 minutes the final thing to go into the pot is the juice we extracted as i said there's the last thing to go into the pot but if you feel like adding in some peppers onions or whatever feel free to add it into it I am going to cover it and allow it to simmer beautifully and thus is after 20 minutes of simmering I added some okras off camera and that soap tastes absolutely good now you know in the absence of garden eggs you can use cabbage to make your Ghana light soup and enjoy with no problem 
Now check out the next video. You will love it. Enjoy the light soup with Fufu. As always, thank you so very much for watching this video. And hope to see you around next time for another recipe. Until then, cheers.